Hey YouTube, Crystal here, and today I have a thrift haul, but it's not like from one day, it's from several weeks because, let's face it, you don't find a lot in thrift stores around here. So yeah, let's get started. Okay, up first is this Padme Amidala doll from Star Wars. Night. She was made in her, she says 1989, and Forgive me if I said her name wrong. Yeah, we'll just. I picked her up at a thrift at a thrift store for a local thrift store in my area for five bucks. I thought she was pretty awesome for five bucks because she has a lot of detail. Like, look at this. She has a scallop on her bottom of her dress. I don't know if it's gonna focus. It's really beautiful. And the gold. This is like a, over, a lace overlay over her gold dress. Underneath. And she has like sleeves. Her sleeves and her head piece is pretty awesome with these feathers. And yeah, I'm sure she's missing something right here. There's a hole right there. Yeah, let's get a good close up of her face and headpiece because it's pretty awesome so yeah and let's let's get a good view of the back too because it's got a nice long trail with nice embellishments and let's lift that up and that yeah okay Disney store and I didn't do any I didn't look her up or anything but yeah I found this I believe this is a toddler what is her name? Oh my. Yeah, don't. We're gonna look. We're gonna take a look at her. Well, I remember her name. <laughs> so crazy. Alright. Still not coming to me. Look at her hair. Her hair was in pretty good. Her hair was in pretty good shape. Yeah. And she's from the movie Brave. Oh yeah, her name. Yeah, now I know her name. I really like her, which is really crazy why I don't know her name. Her name is Merida. And she's really cute. She even... I don't know if these are her... Are these her shoes? They look kind of... Um... Different color in her dress. I don't know. Well, anyway, she has shoes. Well, let's go with that. This stuff... Jasmine, I'm not sure where she's from either, but there's a free toy thing at our thrift store. They put stuffies in, so yeah, I picked her up from there. I had to get her because I don't have any Jasmines. So yeah, she has no tag whatsoever, and she's a little frayed right here, but I was thinking I could fix that. We have a uh, Stuffy, stuffed mead, bean bag Aladdin. I think this is from the Disney store. And I picked him up at the at the flea market for a, I think like a couple bucks. And I also found Genie. Yeah, he needs he needs cleaning. Yeah, he's he's otherwise than cleaning, he's in good shape. And I believe he come from the Disney store also. Yeah, so there we have G. Oh no, he's he says Mattel. Okay, he says Mattel, 1993. It's a Barbie bed, but I thought it'd be pretty cool to use for my Monster High dolls. Like create like a little bed set for it, and I could probably even do a little canopy up here. Yeah, I might do that. The colors, because I think I would probably leave the colors because they kind of work. Yeah, okay. This figure from the flea market. Dark Phoenix. Famous cover series from Marvel Comics. It's the first appearance of Dark Phoenix. Well, the comic. And... Eight, she's an 8 inch posable 
figure with authentic fabric costume. And she's made by Toy Biz. Okay. So let's open her up. She has a pretty, her box ain't, or isn't in the best shape, but she has a good, it's a nice box. It would be nice if it was in better shape, but for five bucks, I thought she was great. I like, I like to try to collect the female comic books girls, because I'm a girl, so girl power. This is probably silly. But I just thought I would show it. It's hootie, it's heatable hootie and friends, scented with French lavender. Oh, so there's all the little ones you can get. All the others are owls and one little fox. Yeah, so you just pretty much heat this up in the microwave, and if you have a sore muscles or something, you feel like heat him up in the microwave and plop him on you. He's like a beanie type. Yeah, I thought he was. So cute, even if you don't, well he is kind of heavy, even if you don't use the heat up you could just plop him down like so, yeah, thought that was a really cute find. Also I don't know what that paid for that one because it was in, I just put it all up there and get a price, so yeah, and um, I don't, I never tried it out, so I don't know if it works, but I found this weird, oh, weird Furby, and it's, I don't, I don't know if it's eyes open or if it needs batteries, it just said one thing, I believe it said cock-a-doodle-doo, <laughs> yeah, and this is Furby, here Furby was from 2005, yeah, I thought, this is a strange one, so, yeah. Yeah, it, it might not work, because all it seems to say is, cock-a-doodle-doo. So, I believe it was brand new. The box is just inside a little damage. It's like a jewelry work, a Monster High fantastic jewelry work shop. So, yeah. I bought this thinking I might do some like jewelry for my Monster High girls because it's got some little, it's got some pretty cool Monster High pieces in there. But they might be a little large for the dolls. I don't know. I'll see. But yeah, make some jewelry when I, I ever found that 2,500 beads. Wow. And this was, I picked this up for $4 at a local store in my area. And you get the bracelet web, skeins of floss, eight charms, and a bead spoon, some string for making bracelets. Yeah. So I thought this was a kind of cool find for only four bucks because I can make a lot of things with this. All right. That's it, YouTube. Thanks for watching. Remember to like and subscribe. Bye.